Hello everyone, welcome to Let's Unbound and in today's video we are going to discuss question 12 which came as a 4 marker problem for grades 3 and 4. So let's get started with our today's question. Peter the penguin goes fishing every day and brings back 9 fish for his 2 chicks. Each day he gives 5 fish to the first chick he sees and four fish to the second chick. The chick eat all the fish they get. Over the last few days, one chick ate 26 fish. So how many fish did the other chick eat during those days? So we know that there are two chicks. Let's say we are having chick one and then we are having chick two over here. Okay. Let's say chick one ate 26 fish in the last few days. But each day, the chick can get either five fish to eat or four fish to eat. So our motive is to split number 26 into the pairs of four and five. So what we will see from here, we know that 26 is not divisible by five, right? It does not come in the table of five. Along with it, it does not come in the table of four as well. Correct? It is not divisible by four. So what we will do, let's focus on just one number 5. As 26 does not come in the table of 5, is there any smaller number that comes in the table of 5? Smaller than 26 but divisible by 5? Yes, you are correct. It can be 25, 20, 15 or 10. Right? Let's say chick 1 is eating 25 fishes. For most of the days, he got five, five fishes, right? But then we will be left with one fish, correct? 26 minus 25 is one. So that means we cannot do this because either they can get five fishes or they can get four. So whatever answer we are going to get, the remaining fishes, that should be divisible by four, right? So that first few days let's say if uh, the chick is getting five fishes to eat so the other days the chick should get four four fishes to eat as one is not divisible by four we will not take 25 let's say if the chick has eaten 20 fishes for the starting few days so she uh, the chick will be left with six right that is again not divisible by 4. We will not take it. Now if we see 15. Let's say for the starting few days. For the first 3 days. 5 plus 5 plus 5. The chick is eating 5 5 fishes. But for the rest over days. It should be 4 4. Right? Let's see. 26 minus 15 is 11. 11 is again not divisible by 4. So we cannot split into 4, 4, 4. Last one says, okay, let's say for 2 days, the chick got 5, 5 fishes. So for the remaining days, the chick will get 16 fish, right? 26 minus 10 is 16. And yes, 16 is divisible by 4, correct? So let's say for the starting 2 days, the chick 1 got 5, 5 fish. And then for next four days, one, two, three, and four, the chick got four, four fishes to eat. Because four times four is 16, right? So that is how we can split 26 into the pair of five and four, 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 four. Okay, so that means 5, 5, 4, 4, 4, 4. In total, we had how many days? 6 days, right? Now to find out how many fishes second chick ate, what we need to do is we can just replace 5 with 4 and 4 with 5, right? Because of chick, if chick 1 is getting 4, then chick 2 will get 5 fish to eat. If chick 1 is getting 5, then chick 2 will get four fish to eat right that's it now you can add this and you will get your answer let's do it 
Let's start with the easiest thing. We know that skip counting of fives is super duper easy, right? So 5 plus 5 is 10. 10 plus 5 is 15. 15 plus 5 is 20. 20 plus 4 is 24. And 24 plus 4 is 28. That means check 2, 8, 28 fish. That is our answer. I hope you liked the tutorial. So if yes, don't forget to hit the like button below and I will be seeing you soon in the next video. But till then, if you haven't joined our WhatsApp community, so you can join it by clicking on the link given in the description box below. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.